This is me, John Perry, filling a Lego maze with sand and tap water. Why? To test a claim made by speakers at TED that slime mold is intelligent. These claims can be linked back to an old study where it was shown that slime mold is capable of consistently finding the shortest of four possible pathways through this maze. Can you spot the shortest path? Even people often fail this test. It's this one right here. Researchers proposed that slime mold success here might mean that cells possess a primitive form of intelligence. I disagree. Here I've set up an experiment to test if clearly non-intelligent substances, tap water in this case, are also capable of solving this maze. Now, don't get me wrong, cells are clearly competent. They've evolved to be competent at finding food, surviving, and reproducing, but when it comes to solving mazes, just like tap water, slime mold has no idea that it's solving a maze. It has no idea what a maze is. It's just doing what slime mold evolved to do. They are competent without comprehension. And look at that. Regular tap water just passed an intelligence test proving the test can't actually screen for anything we'd want to call real intelligence. Until actually proven otherwise, I think it's best to just say that cells evolved to be competent without comprehension.